Football is the global king of sport and it streams through the veins of die-hard Vietnamese fans. Like the electrifying atmospheres of international stadiums around the world, but with a special Vietnamese twist, Football Fever here promises every expat football fanatic the blast of their lives. If you're an expat who just came to Vietnam and wondered how you might feel your football crazes, well, you might as well just start right here in the middle of football craziness in Meeting International Stadium. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's get the party started. There's a foul! The cổ động viên bóng đá Việt Nam thì tuyệt vời luôn. Tất cả là màu cờ sắc áo đỏ rực một sân vận động Mỹ Đình và những cái làn sóng. Chạy vòng quanh không khí của bóng đá Việt Nam cực kỳ là sôi động. Joining the Red Army of football fans, you may get to indulge in heroic tunes of Vietnamese patriotic music you start to rock and roll in rhythm of Vietnamese football chants. Cổ vũ Việt Nam thì hát về những cái tiền chiến, hát về những cái quấy động, những chiến binh ra trận. Occasionally, this chant even win the hearts of our adversaries as well. Some even defected to the Red Tornado. I'm here to support Vietnam. I like Australia, but I love Vietnam. United by the love for Vietnamese football, fans have disregarded all rivalries to put on an astonishing display of passion for football. Cái thanh quản của chúng ta nhỏ nhưng mà chúng ta tận dụng được để chúng ta phát huy nó thành những hoạt động cổ vũ coi như là nó nó gây hiệu ứng trên sân. Now that you behold international football played by professionals, you might want to experience it for yourself. As usual, every game begins with a warm-up session, and video game lounges like PS4 Paradise have all the facilities. Oh. So in Vietnam, not only is played by foot but also by hand as well. The best way to warm up before an important football game is through virtual football. Besides, you get yummy food, trains and free Wi-Fi as well. What more can a football fan ask for? Next time mate, next time. Before things get real physical at a football match, players or fans often take to football video games like FIFA or Pro Evolution Soccer at home, except that Vietnam has a different take on the virtual football atmosphere. Tất nhiên là nó phải sôi động hơn. Bạn thử nghĩ đi, bạn chơi một mình một mình ở nhà kể game nhập vai hay là bóng đá cũng thế đúng không? Thì cái không khí ở trong nhà lúc nào chỉ một mình bạn, bạn cảm nhận được cái không khí đó thôi. Còn đây ở xung quanh bạn có rất nhiều người trong một căn phòng có khoảng tầm 6 đến 10 người mỗi người tạo lên một cái không khí riêng và nó cùng sôi động cùng với cái trong cái phòng căn phòng đó. Vietnamese game lounges are often packed on footy day with screen after screen of footy played by virtual Messi, Ronaldo or Neymar. Through video games, fans can find redemption for grey football defeats or make football fantasies come true. Time's up for virtual football. Now it's time for some real action as we take you to grassroots pitches where expats and locals, no matter the cultures, share the same language of football. Hello again, this is your own Michael Lou coming straight from Royal Arena to bring to you all the excitement of this interesting fixture between Checho FC and Real Madrid. 
However, due to a last minute transfer, I've been selected by the guys of Real Madrid to join the action. Well, it's time to represent KTV and time for kickoff. Hello boys, how are we doing today? Yeah, yeah. Good. Yeah. Right, so your opponents are over there and they look really dangerous. So, um, have you got any secret weapon for today? Okay guys, we are different individuals, okay? We all have our own strengths and weaknesses, but the only weapon we have today is to play as a team, to fight as a team, uh -huh. and everyone fight for each other. That's how Unreal Madrid has been for the past seven years, it's okay? It's teammate, man! Yeah. Seven years of age, Unreal Madrid is a strong unity consisting of overseas Vietnamese and expat footballers that regularly host games with the local and international communities in Vietnam. Today, they take on another fearsome expat adversary of English teachers from Checho FC. Something that's uh, common between uh, the Western and the Eastern culture is a love of football. Um, we all like playing football and having a good time and being able to play with Vietnamese friends and against Vietnamese teams is a great way to you know, kind of socialise and get to know the area and the people that live here. Some foreign football fans are even amazed at the Vietnamese passion for football shown across football fields here. So many pitches around Hanoi, uh, more than I've ever seen in the UK. So I think perhaps the love of football in Vietnam is bigger than in England. Um, a lot of us just turned up to a football pitch um, and uh, some Vietnamese people invited us to play with them. Uh, we just came to watch but ended up playing. Despite a shaky start, and Real Madrid came back from behind and snatched the game 5-4. However, both teams came out a winner as they both won heart of each other through the gallantry on the field, diverse football styles and the love of the game. <laughs> 